Well, it's Saturday morning. We got some breeze. Tides low right now. No spin for me. I got a birthday party to go to. From that little gentleman you saw here last weekend, Mr. Canyon. I got some knives. A few scissors, pruners to do. Now, this big knife is a carver hall. And in the 40s and 50s, my father was in the seafood business, in, in the oyster business mostly, and we used Carver Hall oyster knives. They made oyster knives for shucking oysters. And of course they made other kind of knives too, crab meat knives or picking crabs and things like that. I didn't know they even made big knives like this before. Then we got a Cafalon, and we have a Faberware, and then we have a nice Shun. Shun. That's some damage. We got into contact with some chicken bones. Mmm. Everything over here is Chicago cutlery. And we have a... I can't even say it. I-K-E-A. Ikea. Ceramic knife. Some pruners and two pair of scissors. One pair is, I don't know, one's a cobalt. We'll make quick work of this. I don't know what else the day is going to bring, other than the birthday party. But that shun is a. Uh, I got some, I'll have some better pictures of it. You can see it's in rough condition in one spot. That chicken bone worked on it. Okay. Stand by. Well, just finished up everything but the ceramic knife. I worked on it for about 45 minutes, and it still needs a lot more work. While I was sharpening, one of my neighbors came over and brought me this green taquito right here. Can you sharpen this up? It's got some coating on it. I said, sure, bring it right in here. Let me have it. <laughs> I do a lot of these little coating knives. I'm sure everybody does. The Santuco is no longer chippy. All the bone stuff is out of it. It was right about in the center. You'll be able to see the pictures at the end when I put them in there. She's ready for Freddy now. Back to good shape. I did these knives for this lady once before. Not these knives, but she has a set of shuns that I did for her in January. And this was one of the set. But after I sharpened it, I guess that's when it encountered the uh, chicken. Chicken bone, I should say. But we got it back in shape now. Nice scissors. Pruners. I had to clean them up. They were kind of nasty. But they're all uh, cleaned up nice on my buffer. Okay, I guess that's it. For the roundup at Rancho Max with these knives. Got to box them up and Chris is going to take them back on Monday. Except for the nice little ceramic knife. Or I should say the big ceramic knife. Okay, I got to go. I'll check back with you later. Well, 
I'm done. All boxed up, sheathed up. Waiting for Surf Church Sunday.